out-of-state horses aren't just coming here today at Del Mar. Horses are actually traveling down here from the I-5. The horse right over my left shoulder is Johannes. He just stepped off the van here at Del Mar not too long ago, just about 945, as you can see him right behind me. Oh, he doesn't want to play now. He's being shy. He's going back in his stall. Let's see if we can go behind here and see if we can see Johannes. Yeah, so he just stepped off the van here, guys, and it just arrived here to Del Mar. Look at his Breeders' Cup pedigree. He's by Nyquist, who won a Breeders' Cup race. Nyquist is the son of Uncle Mo who won a Breeders' Cup race. So he's looking to become the third generation of Breeders' Cup winners with Nyquist and Uncle Mo as the sires on the top side of his pedigree. And how sharp is Johannes right now, guys? He's won five in a row. He's won six of his last seven. He's a grade one winner. He's undefeated this year. He's a perfect four for four. Those four graded stakes wins, the American, the Shoemaker, the Eddie Reed, and also the City of Hope. The Eddie Reed, of course, right here at Del Mar. That was nine furlongs at a mile and an eighth. The course will be shortening up and trip from his most recent start here at Del Mar and his only start here at Del Mar in the FanDuel Breeders' Cup mile. So Johannes, guys, looking to give trainer Tim Yachtin his very first Breeders' Cup victory as he looks to make it six in a row in the FanDuel Breeders' Cup mile. Let's go to Andy Biancone.